We know that the world is moving very high on software engineers. Everybody, the biggest job market which has been created as of now is coming from the software industry. So software engineers have a vital role to play. Now, when it comes to hiring software engineers, what is the preparation that the recruiters do and what is that they need to look at? Let's highlight software engineers. Software engineers are some of the most sought after talent with the average engineer receiving three times as much as the recruiter interest on LinkedIn as the average member in this competitive hiring landscape. Finding top talent that excels in both hard and soft skills can be really, really tough. So let's figure out as to what all top soft skills you know qualify to become a top trade for even software engineers. The first one is adaptable. The top candidate will be as comfortable with day spent debugging and writing code as they are with navigating multiple programs. One is adaptable. Second is team player. Great engineers know that no individual or team can make companies successful on their own. They need to realize the importance of working together for a greater good or for the benefit of the company. Third trait which comes very discreetly is approachability. The readiness to teach and help others means a candidate has built a strong rapport with their team in the past and that they are good communicator. The fourth in the series is curiosity. A willingness to embrace continuous learning is essential for successful engineers because trends and technologies are always evolving. Last one year with software engineers is takes ownership, ownership. Independent thinkers can provide unique solutions to problems and have the ability to recognize when they need to work independently and when the help of colleagues is required. Let's take each and every personality trait and frame it in a question and seek the sample answers towards it. First question for software engineers is adaptive on adaptability is in what kind of environment do you do your best work? The sample answer could be there is something to be said for working in a large organization and the safety net that comes with being part of a big team. However, in my time working with a startup, I learned much more about what it takes to make a business successful beyond just lines of code. And what is that one should listen to is look for candidates whose answer show a real understanding of the demands of the role you are hiring for. You want their answer to be realistic, but also demonstrate awareness to the expectation of your specific organization. Number two. How uh, one responds to a question of being a team player. What distinguishes a great software engineer from a good one? Do you feel you have these qualities? And a sample answer could be a great software engineer knows that they can't do everything and that it takes a team of people to get the job done. I believe I have making of a great engineer in myself because I'm willing to ask for help when I need it. At the same time, I know what I'm good at. When I can, I offer my services in the places I excel. It's all about balance, really. What to listen for in this particular answer is this question can provide insight into the thought process of a candidate. Look for an answer that shows initiative and communication skills. Traits often overlook for someone in an engineer role. This particular answer shows humility since they are also willing to ask for help. 
a candidate who understands the difference between pragmatism and perfectionism will benefit your organization for sure next question would be on approachability describe a situation where you had a positive effect on someone what did you do what did you do how did the other person react and a simple answer could be during a time of rapid growth in my last company we were hiring engineers right out of college at one point i noticed a young developer struggling with their workload i didn't want to point out that their struggle was evident but casually offered a few tips i had learned over the years eventually the employee came to me on their own and i was able to assist in a more official capacity just a few months later i was able to ask that same developer for help on another project and what is that one should look at is being approachable is essential in the role of a software engineer you will want someone who knows how to work well with others and offers assistance for the greater good of the company curiosity let's have one question on curiosity do you have any hobbies outside of work and the sample answer is i am a big believer in giving back so i volunteer with a local non profit government organization that helps the homeless it gives me a better sense of working with all kinds of people and understanding that everyone has different needs and motivations and what is that one should listen to is someone who has a hunger for exploration is eager to learn too a candidate with a curious mind is more willing to ask questions and might be more engaged in the office they could also bring new ideas perspectives or strategies to the business let's look at the next trait takes ownership let's have a question phrased on this discuss one of your previous projects that didn't go smoothly explain how you dealt with those challenges to complete the project successfully the sample answer could be when my team realized a deadline could be missed i opened up a dialogue with other stakeholders and quickly determined that the best course of action was to strip back some of the less crucial features to allow us to launch on time with a functioning product what is that one should look at in the answer is this question allows you to identify whether the candidate can take control even if they generally work alone it can help you understand their other skills such as time and project management of course the conclusion would be drawn here that as a hiring manager you have got a tough job ahead of you finding a candidate who meets all the necessary criteria in 30 minute of an interview is no small task at all with this video recording we are trying a level best to make the two ends understand that a sample interview question and answer for today's most in demand job as well as tips for analyzing every answer would be of great help use them as a guide in your own interview if you are an interviewer and if you are an interviewee it gives you immense opportunity to tell something about yourself in this particular direction the objective set is very very clear that today's scenario is a toughest one we all know that we are going through a, a tough torrid time where there will be less jobs but good material will always find place when we see the analysis of jobs being missed by many we only come to know that there is some readiness flaw that preparedness flaw which in time if you could have oriented yourself or exposed to you would have certainly mastered it so it's always your preparation starting early and getting started to know what it takes 
to prepare well and once you are shown that kind of an experience through such learning i think you are more than prepared as it sounds so here is here we all are wishing you great great luck prepare well now since you know many things do a great justice to your uh, last year of your preparation in your colleges invest time and take help of lot of videos and readings like these i hope this research and survey would have gone a long long way it would definitely go a long long way in preparing yourself best not only for sales for marketers but also in the software industry which is a great industry which is emerging ever emerging industry even in the future yes wishing you a great luck